Good morning, everyone. I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. There was a magnitude 6.5 earthquake in Nevada early this morning, about 4 o'clock local time. On USGS, 14,324 people have reported feeling this earthquake. It was shallow, only 1.4 miles in depth or 2.8 kilometers in depth, and there's been a lot of aftershocks. On EMSC, I don't know if they're reporting, they should be reporting the effects of the 6.5, but they are saying here that it shook for about 30 seconds. Um, hanging fixture swayed, items moved, another one smooth rolling and shaking, creaking throughout the house. It seemed to last for 20 seconds. First, I felt one this strong in um, it's very common quake territory. Yeah, they've been having a lot of quakes in this area. And I've reported the, the different fault lines and everything. Um, this one here says Felton Quake in Mammoth Lakes woke us up. Seemed to have lasted about 20 seconds. Twice. First one smaller, but things in the house weighed for a long time. My dog knew hours ago because she kept jumping out of the bed and hiding in the kitchen. I had to bring her into the bed twice while I was scared. Um, Yarrington, Nevada. My cats woke me up about 6 o'clock this morning, central daylight time. Um, the cat literally running across my body. And the cat is currently still going crazy. Um, my cats have been very, um, oh, clingy lately, wanting a lot of tensions. Um, I think my dogs are broken. Had to wake them up, bed rolled, and hanging objects in room swinging. Just felt an aftershock. Woke up after the shaking. Lantern shaking. Woke this, woke from sleep. Dogs barking moments before. Yeah, dogs, animals often feel these earthquakes. Yeah, it's been about an hour and a half since the cats woke me up, and there's that earthquake, and you can see, yeah, about an hour and a half ago that this earthquake occurred. It came in at Yellowstone. Let me pull this over so you can see it. Yeah, the cat um, is definitely going crazy, literally running from one end of the apartment, um, across the couch, up on the cat uh, condo, back and forth, back and forth. Yeah. So this is the initial wave of the earthquake. And you can see the P wave as it came into uh, Yellowstone. Um, oh, a little less than 30 seconds later, later, and then we got another one that shows up here that's fairly strong. There's been a lot of aftershocks. I count 22 earthquakes since the main shock that USGS is reporting. Here on EMSE, we got 3.0, another 3.0, 3.1, 3.4, 2.8, 4.0, 3.5, 3.7, 4.0, 4.0. Two point nine, three point three, three point three, uh, four point two, four point eight, four point seven, three point nine, and three point eight after the six point four. On geoscope, we can see that the fault lines moved. Here we got during the earthquake, it moved, uh, going east, and then we also got it going north. Using Google Earth, here's the location of that earthquake. I've talked about how, yeah, there's things happening, um, how the continents are moving. Um, yeah, right down here, we have, <laughs> let's see, Indio craters, Mono craters. This here is uh, an area of fairly recent lava flows, volcanic activity. Um, the North American craton is slowly moving towards the uh, southwest. Yeah, I've talked about that. Felt reports. Too bad you can't get uh, felt reports from animals. Yeah, all the way down to Santa Rosa, San Francisco, San Luis Obispo, Los Angeles, um, Salt Lake City. Where else we got down here? Yeah, it was felt over a very large area. Uh, down here in New Mexico, um, the um, 
um, Hopi Indian Reservation. Yeah, almost well, all the way down to San Diego. Most people said it felt like a rolling sensation. All I can say is good thing this was in a very remote location. Uh, shaking and cracking sounds in the house woke me up. Everything swaying. Longest quake I've felt. 20 seconds is nothing. Um, if you have a very major earthquake, um, they can last for three, four minutes at a time. Let's see. They were, what, 196 kilometers from where it was occurring. Yep, definitely 2020 is something. <laughs> yeah, a year to remember. Yeah, a lot of aftershocks. So did you feel this earthquake? I would be, be, be prepared for something much long, larger. I've been talking about that. Um, yeah, the fault line moved. Um, showing that the uh, plates are moving. Put your thoughts and comments down below. Thank you for subscribing. Please stay safe. Let's see, we got another one down here. Um, yeah, Little Lake, California. Looks like the energy's kind of moving uh, south. Yep, yep, yep. South, southwest. Um, if you live down in this area, um, in Southern California, I would be prepared. Um, have your bug out kits packed and ready. Have a plan. Yep. So, please put your comments down below. Thank you for your support. Please stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.